What's up guys, it's your boy Z Dizzle, and today we're actually in Gorilla Tag. And I'm here to actually show off some of the, the Z-Dog natural gorilla skills. <sighs> but first, huge shout out to Yogs VR. They sent out their long arms dual extension game grips. These dudes, and they are dope. Left controller, left grip, put that on. Velcro goes to the inside, around, through the loop, down nice and tight, over again for the Velcro to actually hold on. That is not going anywhere. It's not going into your grandma's face. It's not going into the TV. It's not going into the ancient artifact your grandpappy brought back from the war. Especially if you put on your safety strap that is actually hooked up to the grip. Lock that on. It's not going anywhere. You may wonder to yourself, why would I need these? Not only do they provide a nice, soft, foamy grip, which works perfectly for a game like Beat Saber, but you can also unscrew these safety straps back here and connect this middle attachment so you have one big old controller now. Now, why would you want this if you're kayaking in VR, but also even if you're just playing Beat Saber? It is really fun trying to Darth Maul your way through some Beat Saber blocks with this thing. But the main reason we're all here is to know, are these good enough to make you feel like you're cheating in Gorilla Tag? These arms can only reach so far. If I'm falling from a tree, miss it by a couple inches, I'm done. But these, these might give me the couple inches I need. So here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna jump straight into a Gorilla Tag game without these grips, just regular controllers. See how I fare, and then put these grips back on and see how much I improve. So let's jump right into it. Use the referral links in the description to support your boy Wacky Zack and use discount code Wacky Zack on Yogs VR for 20% off any product. Alright, we are in Gorilla Tag. Regular controllers, nothing fancy going on. We're gonna get a control. See see how my movements are, my, my dodges. Uh, I don't know what other moves there are on Gorilla Tag, but we're gonna check it out. Alright, infection. Let's get this bread. Before I start analyzing my own gameplay, I need to watch some pro stuff, some real top tier, S tier Gorilla Tag player clip to compare them. And I found just the dude. Bacon G Tag is one of the goats of Gorilla Tag. I'm just gonna show a clip for one second of just this thing that just made my jaw drop. I needed a pillow on the floor to catch my jaw because I don't even know what I saw, but it was dope. Now that we know that I suck large turds, uh, let's analyze the control recordings. That's a W. That's a W. Oh! So this clip right here shows off my real talent and skill in Gorilla Tag. You know, I'm going up this staircase. I've got some decent speed. I'm, I'm keeping up with my own hands. But uh, then I miss a branch and I fall. This clip right here shows off my agility. I, I jump over this guy using the tree. I zoom around this little canyon area. He doesn't know where I am. Boom. Where are you, buddy? Where are you? He's left in the canyon lost. He doesn't even want to move. He's targeting. He's targeting. He's targeting. Dang it. Who's it? How did someone get up there? The strategy I employed right here is actually very known to the Gorilla Tech community, where basically if you see someone really good, uh, you just give up and hope someone else gets them. I've been practicing this movement and strategy for years, so I got I, this one I've gotten down. The pillar climb up the side of this wall is a clean and elegant move, and I pulled it off at a slow but consistent speed. As I'm pulling up to the goat of the lobby, I get nanometers away from this green monkey. If I just had a couple more inches of reach like the grip extenders give you, I would have definitely gotten that dude. All right, so that was the control, but now I have extendo grips on. And I'm not gonna lie, this feels so weird. It feels really fast though, I'm not gonna lie. Like, I can really just like launch myself just by flicking my wrist. Like, like this is just gonna be me flicking my wrist. That feels pretty fast. Especially if I like put it like an arm swing and then flick my wrist too. So I think this does give me a little bit of reach compared to just the regular controllers, but it definitely gives me some speed, 100%. Let's jump into this. Right off the bat, put a gorilla six feet under. W. 
All right, now we're gonna have a side-by-side -side comparison. Right side is with the extenders, left side, no extenders, pillar climb. They are off to the races. And what I noticed about pole climbing with the extendo grips is that I was able to reach farther out to the pole and pull myself back in if I was getting too far away. And in this one test, the extendo grips clutched the W. The extendo grips definitely helped climbing up these walls, trying to keep up with this guy. I wasn't able to keep up, but I saw him for like five seconds longer than I thought I would. I wasn't actually able to make this jump without the extendo grips before, so I don't know if I just got better or if they really helped that much, but it felt easy with them. I'm not gonna lie. Slam dunk. The only downside to these controllers is the fact that you're not holding the actual controllers, so you can't grip and grab onto ropes, which does kind of suck because the ropes are super fun to play with. But I think flinging yourself around by flicking your wrist is more fun, honestly, than climbing around on some ropes. Like, I was able just to launch myself vertically straight up to grab onto this little ledge. The extra reach can be a bit of a pain if you have low ceilings, though. Oh, so in conclusion, check out these grips ASAP. I will link in the description and use code WACKYZACK to get 20% off any products on Yogg's VR website. But I think these grips actually do enhance your movement in Gorilla Tag. Like the ability to flick yourself so quickly, it's just faster than swinging your whole arm. If this video does well, I'll make sure to make more Gorilla Tag content, so make sure to like and subscribe, and uh, I will see y'all later.